refund me my 50% did I not get really frustrated did I not become extremely frustrated <laughs> Welcome back, it's your girl Huizi and I'm back again with another video. Thank you so much for tuning in. Please subscribe and if you're my day one subscriber, I got mad, mad, mad respect for you. I promise that I'm gonna give you like a detail, like a, an informative video on my experience with Sheen. As you guys know, um, it's the second time, okay, some of you guys might know because not everyone is subscribed to my channel. So please guys, subscribe to my channel. It really keeps me going. So... I've ordered twice from Sheen and the first time was a really good experience. I really don't want to lie. The second time the experience was experience was really 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 bad. So I really don't want to tell you what other YouTubers have already told you. They've told you how to order it. Either you can order online or you can order using the app, but I prefer the app because it's more um convenient and it's really easy to use. Now Another thing that I need to touch on is that every time um, someone asks me about Sheen, they ask me about their size, like, I'm really scared about the size, I really want to order but my size, I'm not sure whether the clothes will fit. The truth is, like, you won't know if you don't try, like, at least try buy, like, a few items, probably three or four, because my first order, I didn't buy a lot of stuff. I only bought a few stuff so that I can like know my size because you're not sure whether like Sheen's clothes are small cut or like big cut. The thing about Sheen is that when you order, as soon as you click add to cut, it will ask you for your size and then you choose your size it's either it's a small medium or a large if you want um, a, a plus size there's a section for plus size people it will show you that and some of you have already seen this but if you click on more details i don't know but i'll show you guys right here if you click on it it will show you the exact measurements of that clothing item so if you have all the time get yourself a tape i i i was using a tape let me hold on hold on this is the tape that i was using to get my measurements like it took me for almost three hours to get my right measurements but because i've gained so much weight and i became so lazy and then i decided you know what let me just take the bigger size because you know the saying that you know that saying that gold the bigger size is much better than the smaller size because with the bigger size you can be able to like alter it to your preferred size and another thing is that you need to go through the reviews you can't just like order an item you need to go through the reviews because once you get into the reviews, you can see that there are other people who like um, stated all their measurements. Like let's say Huizi has reviewed and Huizi has shown her all her measurements that okay, this is my measurements, I'm a 75 centimeter here, wada 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 and all that. Well, and you need to know what people really think about the product before you decide to buy it. Now you know that when it's the first time you purchase from Sheen, they give you 44 rent off the first time you purchase they give you 44 rent off but you need to be careful because there are other discounts that are there there are other discounts that they offer you so in my first very first order with sheen i used the 44 rent off and i wasn't aware that there's like a 20 percent off and 15 percent off and 10 percent off there but because the pop-up was like your first order you get 44 rent off and i'm like oh i get 44 rent off and i didn't see that and i didn't see that there's like a 10 percent off or 20 percent off 50 percent 15 percent off you need to check that out guys because in this order i used like a different email because i have a lot of emails oh my goodness i used a different email to order this time around and they offered me a 44 rand discount i didn't use it i didn't use the discount but i used like a 50 i used the 15 percent discount and the 10 percent discount because i had two separate orders so you need to like check that out okay now this is where the trauma started this is where like the frustrations started shipping so <laughs> we have aramex and we have buffalo logistics right my the first time i ordered um my my goods were delivered 
by Aramex and this time around they were delivered by Buffalo Logistics. So the only problem was with Aramex, Aramex had a lot of stops. It took a week for the goods to arrive in South Africa. It took a week to arrive in South Africa and with Buffalo Logistics it took four days. It was it five days? It took five days for the goods to arrive in South Africa. And with Sheen, they take only one day to process your order. So let's say you order today, tomorrow they process it. The next day, day three, it is shipped. And you have to then track it on your phone. So the goods arrive in South Africa. In my first order, I paid 370 rand shipping. That was then. That was before Sheen made um, goods worth 1,050 rand free shipping at this point if you go online and order from Sheen, you will get free shipping if you order um goods that are worth 1050 then the first time when i ordered with rmx i paid um 370 rands shipping fee and i was cleared from customs so immediately the goods arrived in south africa um two days later they were delivered I, okay i know that um a lot of people have bad things to say about aramex i know that the drivers are really bad i've had that experience myself like the drivers are just thumbs down but they're like they really deliver and when you call them they answer and they make sure that you get your order no matter what at least that's what i experienced i don't know about other people maybe other people will tell you something different but i get to eat. on the other side buffalo logistics two texts dear Rizona, you have customs jewel jesu <laughs> So I paid customs on both my orders. I got that message. And you know what's weird about Buffalo Logistics? Buffalo Logistics sent me the customs message before the goods even arrived in South Africa. I don't know whether they forgot to update my my shipping status, but they sent me the message while it was still on its way. My shipping status was like on its way to its destination and I got like the sh the customs message. And I was so shook and I was not sure whether I should pay or is this a scam or what is happening. And then they gave me the WhatsApp number. I tried texting them on WhatsApp. They didn't reply. Do nothing. I didn't get a reply. And then the girl was like, ah, Fiji, so you're paying your customs. Try and communicate with Sheen so that they can um, refund me my 50%. Did I not get really frustrated? Did I not become extremely frustrated? Guys, you know what I did? First thing that I did, I went to the Sheen app. Me, you know. Sheen app, I go to customer service. I get to customer service and then I text them and then I see that, okay, this is a bot I'm talking to a bot. And I'm like, I really need to speak to real people. I really don't want to talk to bots. And I'm like, okay. Let us jump. I went to Instagram. The girl gets to Instagram. I typed, was it hi or hello? I don't know. But I actually typed a whole paragraph. Hey? I typed a whole paragraph telling them about how am I supposed to pay customs? My first order, I didn't pay customs. But why am I paying customs? Like, I wanted to understand why. You know what I got? It was a bot i was talking to a bot did i not become so frustrated guys it was so frustrating i really don't want to lie to you i then moved i'd even tried twitter same thing facebook same thing i started attacking these people in their comment section me i'm like comment section they replied go twitter and they told me we're sorry we're experiencing a high volume of messages we're trying to to get back to you jonga it's been a week now like i think it's been over a week now and they're still getting back to me right now so honey if you're gonna order from sheen and say that no i'm gonna get 50 percent of my customs 
<laughs> forget <laughs> forget it these people are not replying so it makes me wonder Oguti, if they if they're not replying to their messages what if like maybe your package gets lost or they scammed you your money you want your money and they do not want to give you your money and you don't know how to get your money like what are you going to do what are you going to do you bought goods worth two thousand and your goods haven't arrived and you cannot speak to anyone you cannot communicate with anyone because they are not replying to messages guys go rev it's tough so i'm out here tracking my parcel it's at buffalo logistics and they hand it over to another courier company i'm out here trying to call them i tried to call them on their whatsapp number and it was like please this is our whatsapp number and then i changed and then i tried to call them on their the number that was on the emails and how are we experiencing high volumes of what 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 fine and then i waited on them i was like okay i'll phone the next morning exactly at 8 a.m and then 8 a.m yeah sharp but i called them i gave her my tracking number she was punching it on the keyboard and then we don't have your parcel here we moved it to a, another um courier company <laughs> i'll give you the courier company's number in their website so you can oh, is it really necessary like was it really necessary like i'm actually being frustrated by sheen that they they're not replying and i'm much here frustrated because my packages are and i moved to another korea and now i have to like track it on their website now and try and call them and ask them about my package and be, mind you i had two packages that time the first package it was still at buffalo logistics and the second package was at fastway but korea company was called fastway it was there and then i was like you know what i have better things to worry about i got stress and then two days later after making the call i got a call from that first way company that hi Huitana, we have your packages please come downstairs was i not happy was i not happy to get that call <laughs> i was so happy to get that call i got my stuff and everything was in there i honestly i really honestly prefer aramax even though i know that aramax um aramax is Customs can be really, 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 really expensive. Their customs can be really expensive. Aramex is extremely expensive, but it's very reliable. Except the drivers, though. Except the drivers. It's very reliable. When it comes to Buffalo Logistics, they do not answer their phones. They do not reply to WhatsApp. They do not even have an Instagram page, Facebook name it they have nothing those people so if you want to order from sheen like you need to like rethink everything eh? if you want to order like probably go small go small and then you'll go big when you're comfortable so um with regards to the timeline of when i ordered when it was shipped when it was processed when it was shipped and when it arrived to south africa i link every l put everything in the description box so head over to the description box and make sure that when you're done heading over to the description box please go check out my try on haul guys you just make sure that you press either button whether you press like or you press dislike honey i'm happy with whatever and make sure that you subscribe go check out my previous video guys go check out my try on haul go and see all the cute stuff that i bought including this cute pink jersey ugh. i'm really in love with it but anyway see you guys soon